Well, you'll often remember that when there has been a popular movie made, oftentimes there is a sequel that will start out as the return of whatever that movie was. The return of the Black Stallion, the return of the Man from Snowy River, whatever. Well, this is kind of along that line. Five years ago, we built the borax wagons and the wagon wheels. Well, this is the return of the borax wagon wheels. Well, I mentioned in last week's video, while I was back east in Maryland, Bobby Tanner, who owns the 20 mules, brought the eight wheels up for the main borax wagons to have these wheels reset. These wagons have been in the Mojave Desert for the past five years now, and they have adjusted to that dry climate. So we are going to make adjustments for the wood that has dried out for the Mojave Desert and reset these tires so that they can go back to the Bishop Mule Days that comes up here Memorial Day, the end of May. Now we've got a storm that's forecast to be coming in this week, so I'd like to get these wheels out of that trailer and into the shop before this storm hits.
Well, back in my high school days, I suffered an injury to my right shoulder that required some surgery to repair that shoulder. Well, all these years since then, I've had to kind of be careful of that shoulder, and I have injured it different times and had to kind of allow it to reheal. When I was unloading this sixth wheel, I strained my shoulder and kind of injured it again. So I called up Dan, who has helped me in the past, if you remember back on the Studebaker wagon running gear that we rebuilt. Well, Dan called his dad, Joe, and they came up, and Dan brought his son along, little Gabe, and they were kind enough to help me unload these last three wheels before the storm came. Well, I sure appreciated Joe and Dan and little Gabe coming up to help unload these wheels. I have to tell you, I did get a little rebuke about being a hard-headed, stubborn German who thinks he can do everything by himself. But I do appreciate them coming up and helping do these wheels. We did get that storm come in. We got maybe about eight inches. And so it was nice to have these in the shop before that storm hit. So once again, we'll get into these wheels, start taking these tires off, and we appreciate you following along. Thanks for watching. <laughs>